All right, guys, got the fuel tank out. Uh, got all of them lines, the old lines, fuel lines out. And uh, we got the fuel cell right here. It's a 3.5 gallon fuel, fuel cell. And then we got all, all of the fittings. V back plans for the uh, turbo for all of my piping. And uh, right now we are doing the pressure regulator. Right now. Yeah. Yeah. And then I'm running uh, 2200 cc's South Bay injectors. <clears throat> and I got a uh, Magna fuel, fuel filter that I'm running. And uh, the pump is down here. I got a 750 Magna fuel, fuel pump, which it's supposed to hold up to 2,000, 2,000 horsepower. But here it is. Yeah. So, we'll see how it goes. All right, you guys stay tuned. What's up, guys? What's up? So now we got to head out to uh, Tractor Supply. We got to get some more uh, drill bits. Uh, we got to get some prongs for the wiring from the uh, fuel pump relay. Relay to the fuel pump. So whatever I'm saying is backwards. So yeah, whatever it is. <laughs> so here we go. So we end up going to Harbor's Freight. I mean, who who doesn't go there? You know what I'm saying? For everything. Who doesn't go there? So here it is. Emblem on a beat. From Prince to Kings. To kings. kings we lead. We, lead. we hustle. We feed our people. Feed our people. We're all kings. Stars, boy. On the come up, see me on the double up. Money stacks so high that is blocking my vision. First, you add, you multiply, then you do divisions. You get a lot of goons and you get a lot of pigeons. A lot of gang shit, a whole lot of it. A lot of motherfuckers doesn't know their alphabets. We make our own language, we speak in own language. We hustle up, getting money, stop burning bridges. 12 gay shotty with a pistol gripping. I don't gang bang, homie, why you tripping? Blood, I got this blue honey like I'm crippin' I tell my prawns, cuz go ahead and bust em Fuckin' with my money is a no-no Hollow tip, got you on the flow, though I came off the top five, fuck your promo I'm on it like a G-Ride, stone low Kevin Knox, known the rock the beat, I hit it proper Pockets fat, bust the strap like we ride McDonald's Blue jeans and a white tee, whole fuck designer I'd rather feed my homies and put all my partners This is for my real hustlers and the pushers, man If you a leader, your whole squad never stood a chance I need that money COD, confirming in advance Last time I trusted a nigga, I lost 10 bands Had to let it go and I ain't give nobody credit since I keep it moving, we gang gang like Yakuza Master the slang of this game without a tutor Every major hustler getting blessed by the Buddhas I'm busy as hell, hustling all day While all these rappers on my timeline sound gay I see them blow up, they fall off cause they heart broke Stop talking hard when you know you're soft, bro Put your man, that's all I know, money, money, I need some more All the hoes hit the flow, it's time to bounce, it's time to go We don't talk to the Bible, I'm screaming fuck the po, -po. Do my dirt on the low, hit you with that po, -po. I stick to the J-Co, I do it for my paper I'm sharper than a needle, I'm higher than a ego I be on the high draw, blowing out, got a smoke I don't like being broke, money talks, bitch and joy I do it for my blood, I do it for my cuz I do it for my dogs, I do it for my cubs so I ain't never up. been Mounting my air motive fuel pressure yeah. regulator on the fire. Ooh, Ooh, sorry about that. I got the hiccups on the firewall and my air pressure regulator. It's a 10 in uh, outlet. So I basically went from an 8 to a 6. Um, they didn't have the 6 to a 10 in, in stock. So this is my return. Um, this is where it goes back to my tank and and from the rail 
that's my feeding and then out let's see get this out of the way and then this is the out it comes all the way down here into this and then it drops down it regulates the fuel and then drops down so we'll see how it goes just got done upgrading my camber kit before it was sitting a butterfly so I'm trying to I'm trying to have my rear end sit straight and we're gonna have the front one done also and then I'm gonna get it corner balanced too So I end up going to O'Reilly's and bought a, uh, a neck filler. Uh, it's like three inches longer than the stock one. Um, I use regular clamps. I mean, it's, it's holding pretty good. So, I mean, it's in there. And I got the vent line too. So everything's sitting in correctly. Uh, we tested out everything and it's not leaking so that's a good part about it so and then from there uh i just ran my fuel relay uh power to my fuel pump down there so yep what up guys so it's now on day two uh we got the fuel cell in we got the pump in we got everything running we got the fuel pressure regulator in uh, it's running fine right now. Uh, it's, it's just that we got to get it dyno tuned and that's gonna be on May 11th and here's garage work. Say what's up, Pumpy? What's up, bro? 100% man. The credit goes to Pumpy. Uh, he does street tunes. You know what I mean? I wish we have a dyno out here for him to uh, do a, a dyno tune and you know what I mean? So I mean he does a lot of tuning for the Northern California area and a lot of people know him. So anyways, Let's go to my car. So this car came a long way. Like this car, I bought it when it was in a LS. In ALS, I threw in a Type R tranny. Uh, I was pretty quick. Uh, I smoke H22 all day in a LS with a Type R tranny. And from there, I went from a LS to a VTEC, and then I, it was actually on a budget built. <laughs> Well, we used all of the LS old stuff and we went uh, LS VTEC with LS timing and all that water pump. Anyways, it's up to you to do that. Well, I did it and I, and I ran it for a year and I didn't have no problems or anything like that. So from there, that's when I went turbo. So I was stock LS VTEC turbo on E85. Uh, uh, Lazy Tune tuned it. And I pulled what 300, 340 horsepower. I ran a 11.7 quarter mile bone stock LS V Tech on E85. I pulled 340 horsepower, did a 11.7. So from there, it's very addicting. So I just end up doing more power. So I end up getting a sleeve block. And basically, I'm fully built. I'm fully built. Uh, I got cams, pistons. Uh, I got Ego pistons, uh, skunk two rods. Uh, my, my compression is nine to one, so it's kind of low. And with a new fuel cell, fuel pump, uh, fuel pressure regulator, uh, with my brand new 6262 Precision Turbo dual ceramic ball bearing. Uh, it maxed out 700 horsepower. I mean, 700, I'm good with 700. I'm not trying to go more. And yeah, so check it out. Uh, I got stuck the last tranny. I had an ITR tranny in there, but I kind of fucked it up. So we're going to rebuild that, put in LS gears, and we're going to throw it back in. Because one legger, <laughs> trust me, one legger at the track feels weird. Like the torque was just not there or like I'm not grabbing as much. So that's on my own experience. So yeah, here it is. So I got Willwood brake booster delete. And the reason why, because I'm on VTEC lockout. 
So with VTEC lockout, there is no vacuum. So that means no braking at all because I'm on lockout. So therefore, I have to get Willwood brake delete. Uh, CNC machine work by Black Works Racing. Yeah. So right now we are working on the hydraulic brake lines and it's gonna go to the firewall. Here it is, Magnafuel 750, running, first startup. It's pretty loud. We got it hooked up to a uh, Bosch relay. Alright, so let's listen to the fuel pump, the Magna Fuel 750. It's pretty loud. It's actually under the car and it's really loud in here. That's all I hear is the fuel cell, I mean a uh, fuel pump.